Hello, welcome back at Transgroom TV. Today it's all about snap-on combs. How to attach and how to detach a snap-on comb. Mostly it's quite simple, but some people and also me sometimes you search how to attach on a correct way. What is the correct blade to use for a snap-on comb? You have three different sizes. You have the size 30, you have the size 15 or 10. You can use all three sizes. Personally, I would recommend and I would definitely recommend the size 30 because it gives you more an equal finish. It's more easier, more smoother with a size 30 than you would use a size 10. You can use a size 10, of course, for uh, a lot of coat. For, uh, if, if you have a poodle, for example, and he has a lot of coat, you would go easier through the coat with a size 10, but a size 30 will give you a better finish. What I have here is the size 30. I have the Showtech white blade, and I also have the Showtech white snap-on comb. So first of all, of course, I put the blade on the clipper, I put the clipper on, I attach. Don't start the clipper when you attach the snap-on comb. You put the snap-on comb and you click the two hooks under the blade. It's really easy, just be sure that the two hooks are under the blade and you pull the snap-on comb over the blade. Just check if the snap-on comb is definitely clicked on the blade because if you start clipping and it's not clicked correctly, the snap-on comb will go off. So be sure before you start clipping. Then you put your clipper on and you go with the comb and you can clip a model or on the length you want, on the size you want, and you can start clipping and do your pre-work before your scissor. How to detach? You pull the blade to you and you click it off. Thank you for watching this video about how to attach and detach the snap-on combs on the snap-on blades. Uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel Transgroom TV for a lot more videos and information and product information. Thank you for watching. See you later. Bye.